Hey everyone, Kyle Coulter here in the ADN studio. It is Monday evening once again, and that means it's time for the American Conference Women's Basketball Weekly Honors. Now, I'm by no means saying it's a certainty, but if you shoot 82% over two games and score over a quarter of your team's points, odds are you're going to win Player of the Week. And that was exactly the case this week for UConn forward Nafisa Collier. The sophomore averaged over 24 points and 9 rebounds for the top-ranked Huskies, including a 25-point, 10-rebound, 4-block, 3-steal performance against Temple. For Collier, this is her third time winning this award this season, which pulls her even with teammate Katie Lou Samuelson for most in the conference. For the fourth time in the last five weeks, the Freshman of the Week honor goes to a hurricane. This week, Kendrian Elliott takes home the hardware after averaging over 17 points and 9 rebounds per game in a 1-1 week for Tulsa. Elliott dropped a career-high 27 points while also picking up a double-double with 13 rebounds in last Tuesday's win over ECU. She then went on to add another 8 points and 5 rebounds against UConn. Some other notable performers across the conference find themselves on the honor roll. Making her first appearance of the season is Houston center Jacqueline Blake. The senior was instrumental in helping the Cougs snap an 8-game losing streak, scoring a career-high 16 points on the road against ECU. Another honor roll first-timer is SMU guard Morgan Bolton. The senior scored a career-high 15 points on 5 of 6 shooting from 3-point range in a big win over Memphis. Temple guard Tanaya Atkinson had another strong week, putting up 20 points and 10 rebounds against two tough opponents in Tulane and UConn. Against the Green Wave, Atkinson led the game in rebounding and was a perfect 5-for-5 five five from the free throw line. Big week for Memphis guard Bria Elmore as she was the only player to score in double figures in both games for the Tigers. She led the way with 17 points, 6 rebounds and 6 assists in Memphis's upset of 20th ranked USF. Now it's not all bad news for the Bulls as junior forward Maria Jesperson lands herself back on the honor roll after averaging a double-double this past week. Jesperson played 79 of the 80 minutes for USF this week and matched a career-high 26 points in a win over Cincinnati. And just a friendly reminder that one month from today, we will be crowning an American Conference women's basketball champion at the Mohegan Sun Arena in Uncasville, Connecticut, and we would like you to be a part of the action. Tickets are now on sale and can be purchased at the address below. That's all we have for you tonight. Congratulations to all of this week's honorees, and thank you all for watching. From the American Digital Network studio, I'm Kyle Coulter.